Okay, Bentley's inside. Shut the door. Uh oh. Help shut the door. Good job. Okay, let's go play with our toys. What happened? Did you not get to say come in, Bentley? Oh, so sad. Should we go get our toy? Okay. Well, spring days last week didn't last very long. It is now snow covered mountains and ground once again. So I don't think we'll be playing outside today, but it sure is pretty. So we just finished up breakfast here. Girls, are you washing your trays? Good job. Did you wash your hands? Well, you threw it. What do you expect? Wash your tray. Are you ready? Should we go for a ride in the car? Yeah? All right. The girls are a little grumpy this morning. We're going to go for a little car ride. Jumping, jumping. <laughs> These girls are crazy. They've taken all the cushions off the couch, put them on the floor, and now they're jumping from them onto the couch. Dad's trying to referee. Jumping, jumping. <laughs> <laughs> Go, Barley. Go, Barley. Where are you going, Heber? Where are you going? You silly monkeys. Are you going to go jumping? Go jumping. Oh, <laughs> they can jump on the couch. You're crazy. You are crazy. So Mama got the kids these new uh, color doodles, and they are so excited. They've each got one. We're gonna open them up, and what are we gonna do? Are we gonna color? Are we gonna color? This one's for Heber. You want Daddy to open it? Okay, I'm gonna get these open for the girls, and then I'll show you them going to work. Okay, so I'd say these are a hit. The girls love them. One of their favorite things to do is to draw and color. I got four little artists on my hands. And these ones are cool because they actually come up in color. So mom did a great job. Oh Ever, what are you drawing? A pumpkin? Oh Can you draw dad a pumpkin? Oh no, this doesn't break it. Look, this makes a little oh shape. Look. Pumpkin. See that? We gotta clear it. Okay, watch this. Now push it on there. Mm. Push it on there. Oh, I'm sorry, sissy. Pie's doing great. Girls, hey, Scarlett, how come you're not drawing? Do you need help? Oh, Can you draw a pie? Oh, Pie's gonna help you, don't worry. Oh, no, it's okay, that comes off. Look, oh. this is a little shape, watch what it does. Watch this. Oh, See that? Oh, cool, makes a butterfly. Yay, do it on your board. Show Daddy. Good job, girls. My artistic girls. So it's already been a busy Monday. The girls are in great moods though. They're happy and they got their new toys and they're drawing and they're being really good for dad today. The bad news is mom is not feeling very good. She got some sort of bug. I don't know what it is. Um, I'm hoping it's not contagious <laughs> and I'm hoping it's just some sort of like food poisoning or something. She just wasn't feeling very well last night and wasn't feeling very well throughout the night. And she's still not doing good this morning. So the rest of us feel great. There's nothing going on. We're happy. We're healthy. Thank goodness. And I'm hoping it stays that way. But poor mama. She's going to be probably laid up in bed today just resting. So uh, dad's taking over. Hopefully I have enough energy to get me through the day. But the girls are doing great. So I'm very optimistic. Okay, you see these two beautiful machines behind me? They pretty much never stop running during the week, so I'm grateful that they have stood the test of time today, and I hope they go a lot longer, but um, especially with sick kiddos, you know, last week these things were going constantly, but today's laundry day. I'm catching up on all the girls' laundry. I've stripped all their beds. We're doing their sheets and blankets today, and then, uh, of course, it's a never-ending story with their clothes, so I just try and keep up as much as I can so with mom being kind of out and down for the count today I'm just gonna do a little housework hang out around here and hopefully she's feeling a lot better tomorrow so we can get back to all of our 
daily tasks and duties, which we, you know, divide out amongst the two of us. Lunchtime. Girls are finishing up here. I'm gonna get them tucked down for a nap. Mama's still out of biz. So dad's gonna finish doing some house duties and then I've got some work to do today. So hopefully these girls take a good nap. I'm really hoping they take a good nap and daddy can get his work done. Good job, girls. All right, so it's a rare sighting. This mama bear is laid up in bed out of commission. <laughs> she doesn't want to show her face. Not feeling very good today, huh, baby? No, I feel horrible. Well, Dad has given you the okay to stay in bed all day. He's going to take over. You didn't give me the okay. You banned me to this room. It's true. I did. I banned you. I don't want you out. You won't let me leave the room. We don't want to see you. If you're sick, you got to stay in bed. Especially if you're contagious. We don't know what you have yet. The verdict's out. Uh, uh, you just stay in here and rest like a mama bear. Uh, I'm in hibernation. <laughs> Daddy's taking care of everything. The girls are being really good today, so you just rest and get better, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, so I've got some reinforcements here today helping me out. Grandma and Hugsy came to say hi to the girls. Thank goodness, because they needed a change up. And we've just got our toy box out, dumped out. We're having a good time just playing with toys. Ezzy is just talking up a storm today. She is just saying every word she knows. And everybody else is just kind of doing their own thing, hanging out with Grandma. So I think this one's missing her mom a little bit today because she will not leave my side. I have to hold her the entire time. I think she's afraid I'm going to leave. So I just left a little bit ago and had to run to a quick meeting. Grandma and Hugsy stayed with the kids. And since I've walked back in the door, Indy will not let me sit down. I'm trying to cook dinner, finish the laundry. It's not happening. Why won't you let Daddy go do something? Huh? Is that Sezzy in the behind us? Yeah, you're so freaking cute. How come you know everything? You're so pretty and you're so smart. Who's that? That's Indy. Indy. Can you say Indy? It's Indy. <laughs> Good job, Heather. Keep going. Can you get the whole floor? Keep coming. Come all the way over here. Push it this way. Good job. Yeah, I got my girls helping me now. Good job, Heather. Yay. Helping Daddy! Yay! <laughs> she loves it. This is my little helper. My little helper. <laughs> Alright, we just finished dinner. I've got crying girls. We're heading up the stairs to take a bath. Alright, we're at that point of the night. I'm almost there. I've got the girls in the tub. Okay, there goes a whole cup full of water all over the floor. I've got the girls in the tub, they've been shampooed, scrubbed, I'm getting ready to get them out, but I guess not before, they make a swimming pool on the floor, so I'm actually going to go right now so I can clean up this mess. So today was a little bit more hectic than I would have planned. I'm hoping that my partner is back 100% tomorrow. It's always rough trying to uh, tackle everything on your own. Uh, the girls, although they were really great today, they had a ton of energy, and so I am like completely worn out right now. Um, on top of that, we've had a few tasks that we're working on right now. One being the house. I had to meet with the builder alone today because Ashley wasn't feeling very well. So I'm going to need to get her all updated on that tomorrow. And uh, just back so we're on the same page moving forward. And then we've also got um, the Miracle Unfolding website that we're finishing up. So we will be moving from Etsy to our own website, which is going to be awesome. It's going to allow us to do a lot more. So we're really excited about that. And then, of course, Ashley's got her business, you know, quadruple the kisses and the vlogging and the blogs, which I'm trying to get more blogs out this month. I've really been slacking on that. Um, but um, doing the vlogging all day by myself and then editing at night, it, it's a lot of work. And so I'm really hoping Ashley's back tomorrow because I feel bad. Sometimes I I feel like I don't get a capture as much during the day as she does. She's so good at like capturing all the moments and you know, pulling out her phone and grabbing good stuff. And whereas I'm just trying to survive, keep my head above water. So I need my partner back. I'm hoping she's feeling so much better tomorrow. Um, 
for several reasons, all of those. And then we're actually supposed to be speaking at a class tomorrow um, at my college. So uh, we're really excited about that. We've done it a couple times. It's so much fun. And um, we're supposed to be doing that tomorrow. So I'm hoping Ashley's feeling better so that while we're there, uh, we can really give our full attention. But say lots of prayers for her and lots of fun and exciting stuff coming up this week as well as this month. So Hope you guys uh, are enjoying the vlogs, and I'm sorry if today's wasn't that great. Uh, I promise I did my best, <laughs> okay? I will see you guys all tomorrow, though, and hopefully Ashley is right by my side. They're the gardener quad squad.